Hey guys, welcome back to another week in medical school. So today has been pretty productive already. I basically woke up and gave two presentations to some high school students on careers in healthcare. And I did that with some classmates through a group that I'm in called MedSpeak, where we basically create presentations to give to our community. And so that was a lot of fun. I'm hoping it was really informative. And so now I actually just got to my school because they're handing out free Panera. We basically just like come and pick it up and then take it home. And it's their way of like staying connected with us since we're all online and everything. And so that's really awesome. I really like Panera. So of course I'm not gonna turn that down. So I'm picking it up right now. And then my classmate and I are gonna go back to my place and do some practice questions. And then I actually have a meeting at three to discuss some potential research opportunities. And then at four, I have another meeting for a group that I'm in called Fight EE. And so it's a pretty long afternoon. It was already a long morning, um, but there's a lot more going on. And we're actually in week two of the real block. So I've made a little bit of headway through content, uh, not as much as I would have liked. And our exam is next Friday. So I've got all of this week and all of next week to get through like content and everything, practice questions. I think it should be enough time, but I'll show you guys a little bit later some of my progress and then my plan for for the rest of the week. Hmm, free Panera. Ah, 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 ah. I took the entire content of the sauce in my mouth, swished it around, and then swallowed. Eat it. Oh, it doesn't even taste good. Is it spicy? That one was better. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> this one just lingers. Yeah. Oh, trust me. That's oh, the one. Oh, this one just lingers. <laughs> that's the one I gave up on. Dude, can I drink some creamer? Yeah, you can have whatever's in the fridge. Oh! <laughs> it's, still... it's pretty bad, right? How'd you... Dude, it took me off. <laughs> Where are you going? Oh my god! <laughs> oh. Dude, I'm so sorry. How do you feel? <laughs> I don't want to talk about it. <laughs> All right, so I just got done with my first meeting. DePaul just left. He did not like the spicy death nut. For context, I'll put a couple of clips from our Twitch stream this past Sunday of Abs and I trying it, which I got to the third one, which is the same one DePaul just did. But Abs did like all five, which is absolutely insane. From getting started, warming up, it's getting real, pain sets in, and the death nut. One. I kind of like that one. It was psychotic. <laughs> <laughs> hmm. <laughs> it's such a slow burn. <laughs> it just looks really. This one is definitely spicier than the other ones. It definitely like dispersed more rapidly. <laughs> <laughs> this one's definitely spicier. This one hurts. <laughs> My ear hurts. <laughs> Gifted a sub, hey. Uh, I might tap out. <laughs> Can you see it? Come on, you have to, for the people. Uh-uh. <laughs> Are you good? My throat and ear hurts. <laughs> 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 Guys, I feel bad. I feel like I should help him. Dude, that I hurt. What are you, oh my gosh. This one hurts, but it's weird because like, it's a nut, so the nut is sweet. But the powder on the nut. <laughs> I'm feeling it now, Mr. Krabs. <laughs> I feel like a baby. You be the last two. I want to like wait a sec before drinking. How does it not hurt? Like you're so weird. Like you, this is an inhuman like reaction. I feel like you're underreacting. 
Anyways, I have some time until my next meeting, so I think I'm gonna lay down for a little bit and then I'll go to my next meeting and I'll catch up with you guys after that. All right, so I just got done with my second meeting, but I wanna show you guys a little upgrade I made to my setup. So this past weekend, I got this little monitorizer, which is basically just like a little stand. It's from the company Jellycomb, and it's cool because it has like this little phone stand so you can put your phone right here, and then like a little bit of a drawer. And the reason I got this was because I didn't really like that I couldn't really push things like towards the monitor, but now if I like pull my laptop out, which I do when I'm like editing, and if I'm using the webcam, I can just like push this underneath it, and it's kind of really convenient. The only thing I don't like is that the actual monitor stand kind of sticks over the edge, uh, but I kind of just got used to it pretty fast. And if you guys are ever curious about any of the stuff that I have in my apartment, especially my setups, I always have the Amazon links in my description just because you guys tend to ask about them. So I've just tried to make it like a habit to just put the Amazon links right in the description box. That way you guys can check them out. Hi, Chewy. I don't know if you've been in the vlog this week yet, but say hi to everyone. Do the legs. Good boy. Let me get you a treat. Oh, man. Dude, this is about to be the worst we've done on any question set. Jeez, dude. I mean, it's over. Yeah, this is. This was very dude, I, for us. I don't know how I like like in. in All right, time to relax a little bit with some Overwatch. Morning guys, happy Tuesday. So I've basically spent my entire morning doing Anki cards and I've got PBL at one, but my PBL instructor is actually treating our entire group to Indian food this morning for lunch. Um, she made a reservation at what's actually my favorite Indian food place here in Las Vegas, uh, which is a lot of fun. I'm really excited. And so that's something that I feel like is very different from like undergrad. Uh, and I tell people this all the time that like our mentors and our professors and the doctors that we get to meet and we get to learn from treat us a lot more like future doctors and future colleagues rather than like, you know, students or people who like want to be doctors. And I know it doesn't sound like that big of a deal, but I feel like it does make a big difference. Like the fact that they just give us their phone numbers, treat us to lunch and actually like make this effort to like build these like personal relationships. It's very different from undergrad and I really like it, but I'm actually running late. So I'm going to start driving and I'll catch up with you guys later. This is like my first time trying all these like different Indian foods. Aw, Bubba's, I'm sorry for leaving you. Aw, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. <laughs> Alright guys, I just got back from lunch with my PBL group and it was really, really good. I am stuffed and super sleepy, but PBL starts in five minutes, so I have to log into that. And yeah, I'll catch up with you guys after. You guys know those naps where you wake up and you're like, what time is it? That just happened to me right now. PBL ended around three, and I laid down on the couch just because I was a little bit sleepy. And I remember my first alarm going off, and I was like, oh, I'm sure I set another one. I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna stop this one. Uh, and now it's a little bit past five. So I just slept for like almost two hours. Uh, I feel really groggy, but I wanna get through Pathoma tonight. And so I guess I better get started. A little bit of an update, I have finished Pathoma, and now my plan is to get through the entire Ninja Nerd Renal Physiology playlist. I've always meant to include Ninja Nerd in my study plans, especially with cardiology and pulmonology, but I just never fit in with my schedule. However, I feel like for renal, it's really important, especially to have your physiology down. And so my plan is to basically watch all of the Ninja Nerd videos, there's about 10 of them, I should be able to finish them by tomorrow, and then start watching Sketchy tomorrow, and then hopefully by Thursday finish Sketchy. And then I'll have finished boards, which I finished the other day, Pathoma, which I finished today, Ninja Nerd, which I'll hopefully finish by tomorrow, and then Sketchy, which I'll hopefully finish by Thursday. And then that's all like my primary resources for this block, and then I can focus on practice questions and review. Morning guys, happy Wednesday. So Chewy and I are about to head to a classmate's house to do some cooking. We have our food meets health class this morning, which I've talked about in the past. We basically do some cooking as a class and we do these like certain recipes that would be good for patients with certain health conditions. And honestly, I don't know exactly what we're talking about today. One of my friends was nice enough to do all the grocery shopping uh, for today's dish. So I'll find out when I get there. The exit to the helicopter pad because the, the, the door to get like, to the top, was, like the lock was always busted. They never knew about it. Yeah. Wow. Oh, that's so that's so cute, uh, if you don't want to deal with the mess of the yellow and yellow, just pop just, it. Like, yeah. yeah. And then just spread it. Like, can... Alright, so we just got done. It was a lot of fun. We made some avocado toast uh, with some poached egg on it and we had some good discussion in the class. So now I'm gonna head home, maybe pick up some caffeine on the way, and then my buddy and I are gonna do some practice questions. Y'all already know that if I'm treating myself, I've gotta get Chewy some. He loves his puppuccinos. Anything else? Uh, no, I feel like that's everything we need to know. Uh. 
All right, so I was doing some practice questions, but then I got a text from the director of emergency medicine research at my local teaching hospital because I forgot to tell you guys this, but I got an email back saying that, you know, he'd be willing to meet with me to discuss some of the research opportunities in emergency medicine. Uh, and my meeting was supposed to be at five, but he texted me asking if we could do earlier, AKA now. So unfortunately I didn't have time to like shower or anything, uh, but it should be okay. And I'll update you guys after. All right, guys, I just got done with this meeting. It didn't take too long. I basically just learned about how this particular mentor works with his students. Some mentors have like project ideas and then they like tell you about them and see if you're interested in any of them. This mentor is more about like the student kind of coming up with a question and then, you know, working to answer that question. And so I didn't really have anything in mind for emergency medicine because, again, I wanted to learn um, you know, how they worked, uh, if they have projects that it would just be easier for me to join in on, or if they want me to develop my own, which is the case in this uh, particular uh, mentorship. So I'll definitely spend some time thinking about some potential emergency medicine projects. I'm still waiting to hear back from some other faculty members who are doing research in different fields, um, because again, you have to do something you're interested in. So I am interested in ER, but you know, I wanna make sure that I get a sense of some of the other projects that are available to me. Um, still pretty stressful. I'm gonna spend some time thinking about it, but for now, I need to keep doing practice questions with my classmates, so I'll catch up with you guys in a little bit. We had a streak that was really bad. Oh, dude, nice, 60. I'll take 60, I'll take 60. So I've been working on my presentation on renal cell carcinoma for PBL tomorrow, but it's time to take a little bit of a break and play some Overwatch, and shout out to Victor for the new headset. Morning guys, happy Thursday. So all morning I've been basically doing my Anki cards and running some errands. I had to pick up some new fish oil for Chewy because the vet recommended that I start giving Chewy some fish oil because I think like his skin was a little bit dry and I guess it helps with the allergies in the coat. Uh, but I tried one and he didn't like it at all. Like he wouldn't even eat his food with the fish oil on it. So I had ordered a different one that some people were saying was working and I put it in his food today and he like already like smelled it and was kind of like eh. I don't want it. So if anyone has like recommendations for stuff like that, I know some people said use coconut oil, but if any of you guys in the comments have any advice, I would really appreciate it. Right now I've got my doctoring class in about five minutes. I think we're gonna be going over differential diagnoses for renal cases. And then at one I've got PBL and I have to give my presentation on renal cell carcinoma and then we'll finish the case today as well, uh, which should be a lot of fun. So we're halfway through PBL. I just finished my presentation on renal cell carcinoma, but we're taking a five minute break. So I'm gonna go cuddle with Chewy a little bit. So PBL ended a little while ago, and I am now back at Dutch Bros to get some study fuel for the night. I have been on such a Dutch Bros kick over the last three weeks or so, but I swear, as soon as this renal exam is done, I'm cutting myself off. All right, so I got my Dutch Bros, and now my classmate's gonna come by, and we're gonna do our set of practice questions for the day, and then I'll probably do some study streaming after. And yeah, I feel like I have a lot to do. The exam's in a week from tomorrow. There's a lot of stuff I wanna get through, uh, but I think, I think we're gonna manage to get everything done. Oh my gosh, we just got wrecked by practice questions. I think we got like a 40 something on AMBOSS, which is really bad. So kind of defeated right now. Exams in a week from tomorrow. Uh, we finished AMBOSS. We're gonna start Kaplan tomorrow. I don't even know what to study since we did so bad, but you gotta stay positive. All right guys, so I haven't been vlogging, but I've basically just been reviewing some anatomy and physiology. I just felt like it was good to go back to the basics and make sure I have all that down. And speaking of anatomy and physiology, I actually wanna give a huge shout out to Ken Hub who's sponsoring this week's vlog. As some of you guys probably know, Ken Hub is my go-to anatomy resource. I started using Ken Hub at the end of last year and I absolutely love it because one of the hardest things about learning anatomy is the fact that you need to practice because you know you could just stare at slides all day, but you're really never gonna retain it. And so Ken Hub has a bunch of practice questions, a bunch of things that you can label, and it makes it a lot of fun to actually practice your anatomy. And so for any of you guys who are currently taking anatomy or you're planning to take anatomy and want to get a head start, I highly recommend KenHub. And if you guys use the link in my description, you can actually get 10% off of any KenHub plan. Again, I want to give a huge shout out to KenHub for sponsoring this week's vlog and for being my primary anatomy resource. All right, buddy, let's get ready for bed. Morning, guys. So I just got done with my first class of the day. Uh, it was my medical ethics class. We talked about confidentiality, which is very important, of course. And then at 10 o'clock, I've got my second class of the day, uh, which is my community service class. And honestly, I don't really know what we're talking about today. Um, but yeah, pretty chill morning. I am super tired. I could not sleep last night. I just felt like I was tossing and turning. Um, but maybe I can get some caffeine after my classes are done and get some energy for the day. All right, guys, class is done for the morning. Uh, a lot of fun, really interesting stuff we discussed. 
Uh, but the plan for the rest of the day is basically just to go through sketchy. I want to get through the farm videos as well as the pathology videos because the renal pathologies, especially like the glomerular disorders, I'm having like a really hard time differentiating. And so hopefully sketchy will help with that a little bit. I watched pathoma already, but even still on practice questions, I get things confused. So maybe sketchy will be, you know, the thing that fills in like the missing pieces. But for now, I'm going to take a break, scroll through social media, and then I'll start studying in a little bit. A little bit of multitasking. I'm in a class review session. I'm watching some sketchy. And you know, Chewy's just vibing. Anything above a 60, I'll be happy. Yeah. Hey. I, think, I was gonna say, I think we gotta sit. Sorry, here's a last important finding. Let's head back to the urine. Glomerular inflammation usually involves basement membrane and photocyte injury as well. And when you lose that negatively charged barrier, say hello to pro. You look so cute in your harness, bubbies. So do you, other bubbies. I think this is fine, me. Hey guys, happy Saturday. So I didn't do a lot of vlogging between yesterday and today just because it was a lot of the same, just some studying, some practice questions. I did some editing for this vlog. And this morning we actually took Chewy and Noya on their first walk ever since they finished all their vaccinations. And it was a lot of fun, but I kind of forgot to film stuff for the vlog. I put a couple clips on my Instagram story, so I'll put that like right here. Uh, but it was a lot of fun. They really enjoyed it. And so the plan for tonight is I'm actually gonna be hosting a social event for some of our incoming students in about an hour, which is why I just got out of the shower. And then after that, it's basically just studying and video editing. And so speaking of video editing, I'm gonna end the vlog here because of course I have to get this up tomorrow morning. So I wanna finish it so I can start editing. But as always, I wanna thank you guys so much for joining me on another week in medical school. By the next time you guys see me, I will be done with my renal exam, which is super exciting. But again, thank you guys so much for watching. Make sure to like, comment, and subscribe, and I'll see you guys next week.